side, our meteorologist Joseph James is here to explain if this nice weather will last. I wish it was. I mean, we're going to probably have one more dry day. A lot of people have the day off tomorrow, so they might have a good opportunity to go for a hike or something. It was nice to get some sun finally, right? Some vitamin D. That's what we need. <laughs> yeah. We need it, yeah. Yeah, we were really excited about uh, the opportunity for that yesterday. We've had about 15 cloudy days because it's been raining just about each and every day this month. A little bit of blue sky was nice. It was nice. Yeah. But notice that the clouds have kind of rolled on in for the Oregon coast. This is our Chinook Winds Casino Resort camera. And yeah, the clouds have kind of moved into areas of Portland as well. So we had a nice slice of our afternoon with some blue sky. Great for a walk. Just getting outside and enjoying some time out there. We have some folks doing a little walk along the Oregon coast right now as well. Expect the clouds there tomorrow. In fact, we will probably see a little bit of rain for the Oregon coast as we head into uh, parts of our day tomorrow for our Monday. Here's Portland right now. Yeah, you know, maybe a little break in the cloud activity, uh, but overall we're starting to notice that cloud coverage and that deck roll on in through the valley too. So we'll keep some clouds in the forecast for our Monday with some showers there along the Oregon coast, up from Astoria all the way down, likely most of the Oregon coast. But I don't anticipate that moisture to really find its way into the valley. If we do see anything, it might be a quick drizzle, and that's about it. I have some more mountain snow on the way for the forecast about midweek, probably Tuesday, Wednesday, and probably from that point on, we'll see at least a little bit of snowfall each and every day from Tuesday all the way through into about the weekend. And then I do have our temperatures a little bit mild. We're going to probably be in the 50s, maybe even the mid-50s some days, kind of like today where those temperatures really warmed up, especially some areas along the Oregon coast, which saw the lower 60s. But the only thing with it is probably going to be a couple rain showers and some wet days. All right, so for your Monday, I do have some clouds in the morning. I'll step out here. You can see that east breeze about 5 to 10 miles per hour. We're going to warm up to probably the upper 40s to about 50 degrees tomorrow. And you know what? I'm not going to rule out at least a chance for a sliver of sunshine as we head through the day. Uh, but I would expect it to be pretty cloudy if you're going to be out and about, but not too wet. Okay, Mount Hood Meadows, great day to be up there. We had some friends up there today, 33 degrees. So beautiful and uh, some wonderful snow up there. Over the last 24 hours, they did collect a little bit. Uh, the base still looking really nice and impressive. Ski Bowl uh, didn't collect anything over the last 24 hours, but it's always a blast to be up there and do some skiing and snowboarding. Satellite and radar showing that cloud coverage off to the west. That's been rolling in through the afternoon, but most of the rain showers still off the Oregon and Washington coast. Again, we'll see that start to fill on in as we go into the overnight uh, hours and into tomorrow. And then notice that we do have another disturbance out there, which will eventually roll on in and bring in some more rain showers for us in the valley. Snow levels do take a bit of a dip on Tuesday and Wednesday, but then they kind of moderate back up to about the 7,500 foot range. Uh, but on that Tuesday and Wednesday, we'll get some good snowfall. Notice overnight tonight we stay dry, but then the rain showers pick up for the Oregon coast. And it doesn't quite make its way into Portland, but the clouds will be here, so we'll probably still be a little dreary. And then we get to Tuesday. Here comes that front, and that's going to bring in the moisture, the snowfall for the mountains. It lasts on and off throughout the day on Tuesday. And then another system on Wednesday is going to keep us wet. And then again on Thursday. So we have a good section of the work week where we're going to see some rainy conditions. And there's Thursday night there. So the coast tomorrow, temperatures in the 50s, some clouds and some showers in the valley. We'll probably warm up to about 50 degrees for tomorrow. You can see with our seven-day forecast here, rain Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and <laughs> same song and dance as we go through the week. Here. Okay, so, t so today and Monday are the nicest days this week. It is, okay. yeah. So, you know, it's, all, it's usually wet in January. It's usually a bit cloudy. So when we get the day like today, you really have to take advantage. Yeah, take advantage. Go outside after you watch this newscast, of course. Yes, yeah. of course. Thanks, Joseph. Now, next